So it is Friday, I think the 25th, 26th, something like that. I am actually headed to the doctor to see what's going on with this arm. Um, hopefully we have some good news. Got my eBay store back going. Um, first sale within like four hours. Uh, the next item I listed, I think it sold within like 12 items, uh, 12 hours or so. So I got that back up and running. All right, so I'm currently coming from my uh, iPhone. I'm in the room. As of right now, I just got a regular Band-Aid on. It's not bad at all. I'll get you guys some uh, photo of it. So uh, guys, I just left the doctor um, office. Got real good news. Everything's looking good. It's healing up. Uh, they don't want me to go back until Monday. So I'm gonna run some errands. I got a, quite a few places I need to run to. Um, I'm gonna head to a car lot. I'm gonna go about to go look at a van. And this is just to get an idea, get a feel of uh, what the prices might be. Because at some point I gotta do some expanding um hopefully so all right so i'm thinking about getting a mv200 at some point all right so i am now headed to my chemical supplier um not stuff that i really need just kind of being somewhat um Proactive. Don't want to get out in the field. I hate getting out in the field and get real low on anything. So I'm gonna head in there and get that, and then we're gonna head to another stop um, and grab some equipment, which I'll show you to show you guys that, and I'll tell you what I use that equipment for. Also, grab a couple things. Most importantly, hand sanitizer. So that's the type of van I'm looking at. Small van, it won't use that much gas. That's uh, my main concern. All right, so we are at Northern Tools. I'm about to grab a piece of equipment. what we're picking up my favorite brand this is like being in a candy store all right as you can see I got it picked up I am headed out Got a couple more errands to run, and we're gonna be all done for the day. So we got that bad boy loaded up. A um, couple more places to run, well, at least one more place to run. And then I'm gonna probably grab some lunch, and I think I'm gonna call it a day. So I gotta get some tires for my truck. So I am at, I don't know if you guys can see that, Raleigh tires. Not sure if I'm gonna get them here or not, but I am gonna price them here. And then I got one more stop. So I, I got the uh, quote on the tires. They're quite a bit more expensive than what I really want to get or pay for. But I kind of asked for it. I wanted something that was um, more of a mud grip style. And I wanted a tire that's a little bit larger. So these are the tires I want. I want that more aggressive uh, tread. I just don't want to pay for them. <laughs> and plus, it's going on a work truck. 
I really just don't want to go that route. These are a little bit larger than uh, what I currently have. And then this is the price on the ones that I really want. But I don't think I'm going to go that route on either one. I think I'm going to go with a lower grade tire, more than likely. Because I don't know how long I'm going to keep this vehicle. Because like I say, it's a work vehicle. And I don't want to put that much money into it. Although I like it, but it's not that serious. Now I'm at Petco. I got to get some... What did he say? Some hay for his um, guinea pigs. I think that's what he told me, some hay. And I had to get a certain type because if not, it uh, bothers his allergies, I guess. He's gonna sneeze, he sneezes like crazy. Now I gotta call my nephew. That the kind? That's what I gotta get. Right, bye. This is the type of thing the kids had you to do. You had to go back and forth and um, get this and get that. What is my nephew? He's a good kid, so. Back at another one of my favorite stores. Gotta get some fuel for the blower. This is another item. This is my second item in a couple days that I've sold on um, eBay. It's a control board for a, um, dryer i misdiagnosed a part and i really didn't need it so i'm just gonna sell it get rid of it. so i got it all packaged up i got to head to the post office to drop it off i already got the shipping label on it i print all my shipping labels at home so through paypal i already got it all set up like i was saying this is my pile i got a whole bunch of stuff over here i got to get rid of uh i think i mentioned on my video i was in the rc so one of my RC cars, one of my hobbies. This is my big boy. <laughs> I'm not gonna sell this one, but I am thinking about selling this one. This is another big one. This is a one six one seven. So I'm gonna sell that one possibly. Got a few runs on it. This one got a few runs on it. Customized. So just jump back in the truck. And I am about to head out. I'm gonna run by the post office, drop this package off, and I think that's gonna be it. I had a lot of things I need to get done um, today. Still got a whole bunch of things I need to list, which I showed you guys the pile. That's just some of the stuff. I got more than that I need to list. As soon as she got off the bed, she ate maybe a banana or something like that. Can't remember what it was, but she said she was going to wait three minutes until she ate. Uh, something that I mean, three minutes. I'm sorry, 20 minutes until she ate something else. It only took her three minutes before she started eating, and she ate like she had never seen before after she got off the water fast. But she did it. She got through three days. She vlogged it out uh, morning and night, um, and it's something that's uh, doable for sure. But it, it's going to be a lot of internal conversation amongst yourself. Yeah, uh, yeah. Definitely, you will, you will have a lot of conversation about what you should eat, why you should. Uh, mm -hmm. how much of a good person you are you should treat yourself right, right you know you don't need to do all of this yeah it's mental more than it is physical your body will be fine your body is actually meant for that uh that's why when you get sick your body goes into fast mode hey we need to send all of our soldiers to heal you up in order to do that we need to limit your food intake so we're not trying to burn food fuel and right. do everything we do when you eat we just need you to settle down and concentrate on this, this, and this, uh, and we can get you healthier. Right at the post office, buddy. Dropping off the package.
come along really well. So I'm about to put up a silly van. It's old one and it's time for it to come down. It's been time for it to come down. Haven't been working it forever. But I'm about to take it down and I'm gonna put up a new one. My favorite brand of tools. Wish I could get some sponsoring from these guys. Had to get it assembled and everything, so uh, the dark caught me because I started real late. Alright guys, it's a moment of truth. I'm about to go flip the switch and see what we have. There you go. So now I just got to finish buttoning it up and uh, get the glow on. Alright guys, all done. I want to thank you guys for supporting my channel. I want to send a special shout out to all my new subscribers and also the subscribers that are already there. Thank you guys. This is uh, another episode of A Day in the Life of Corey. Signing off.